What's up guys, Leopold the Brave here, and, um, I'm doing a death battle reaction again, it's been a while. And even when I did do them, I didn't exactly do the character previews before. But now I'm going to, because this matchup in particular is one I'm actually very excited for. Let me pull the video up right here, okay. Um, I'm a huge fan of both Crash and Spyro. I like Crash a little more, so I'm rooting for him to win the death battle, but I do think Spyro is going to come out on top, just by all the crazy stuff he's done. But anyways, without further ado, let's take a look at this. It's called Crash Dashes Into Death Battle. It's funny because Crash Dash is the level where the boulder chases you and also a power-up you get in Crash Warped, so it's funny. Anyways, let's begin in 3, 2, 1. <clears throat> I was preparing to have the theme song, but I forgot to change it. Hey, Pinky in the Brain! Narf! Take over the world. But I'm not sure Dr. Neo Cortex makes the cut. Why not? He's an evil genius who made a mutant Aussie army of animals to take over the yes. world. Sure, but when it came time to assign a general for this army, Cortex chose, of all things, a bandicoot. Which a no one knew existed. What? You're making that up. It's a real animal. Look. Oh, hey, it's kinda cute. They're How's adorable. Little thing gonna take over the I want one. With the Evolve Ray, Cortex did If they didn't have multiple wieners, that's, that's kind of gross. However, when he tried to brainwash the creature, he utterly failed to create his fearsome general. Instead, he got Crash Bandicoot. So Cortex threw him out like trash, and Crash became his worst nemesis ever. Which is super embarrassing, because this Bandicoot Crash is a few snags short of a Barbie. But his that was really Australian. I didn't even understand what he said there. <laughs> skills like nobody's business. Which is appropriate, as bandicoots are excellent jumpers, similar to their marsupial cousin, the kangaroo. Huh, that I did not know. I thought they were just some random rat thing. Just keep on going, like an energizer bunny of pain. Crash can double jump in midair, slide incredible distances, and use Crash Dash to boost. His hey, there it is. He's also tapped into Mojo, a magic sub. Oh, Mo I forgot about Mojo whenever I would talk about Crash because uh, it honestly doesn't really mean much. Triple Dragon, but his favorite move is the Cyclone Spin. He can even give this move a boost for the Death Tornado technique. Though this can leave him dizzy and prone to counterattacks. Uh, Still, these uh, 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 a fully upgraded Death Tornado spin in Crash of the Titans allows Crash to spin oh, infinitely without getting dizzy like at all. She's like really hot. Hope you remember that in the full episode. At the same time, I'm really confused. Uh huh. While Crash's natural abilities were enough to save him, uh, yeah, Tana was one of the few fictional characters that made us children question if we were furries or not. Just like Lola He's Bunny. Got himself the unicorn of motorsports, the space motorcycle. What I would so cool. <laughs> To increase his firepower, he carries a special bazooka that uses a naturally occurring and easily attainable form of ammunition. Wamba fruits. The same kind of yep. fruit shooter. Apples that can destroy like robots and alien. giant enemies. Uh, I mean, this completely generic looking mech. <laughs> but why fruit? I can't imagine it's a particularly effective projectile. I don't know why I call it an know, apple. Wiz. That's the Remember thing I hate the most. It's I a wampa fruit. My potato gun? Uh, you were stuck in a coma for like a month. Wait, what? You told me I lost that month because my time travel wristwatch finally worked. Uh, <laughs> did? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's right. It was time travel. There's Forget Spyro. He's oh, next stick. to Oh, uh, would you look at the time? Well, gotta go for my uh, Pilates class. Yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> uh, come back next week and we'll talk about Spyro. See you later. You son of a... <laughs> well, anyway, that was the end of the preview, and I hope you guys enjoyed... My reaction, hopefully I'll try and be more energetic in other reactions because I haven't done a death battle reaction in uh, a, a good while, so bleh, I'm just extra excited for this episode. Anyways, let me know what you think down in the comment section below. I'm rooting for Crash, but again, I think Spyro's going to win it, so Leopold the Brave, out.